Who in a conversation is leading a conversation between two people? The person asking the questions. Yeah, most people don't know that. This is the Sales Gorilla Podcast. These are the points that I really struggle with. Um, Starting conversations with people, having conversations with people, and then transitioning from the conversation into the actual sale. So when it comes to which questions to ask to start the conversation, have the conversation and and transition the conversation, um, can we go through kind of what I, I, and I feel like I'm I'm asking you to give a full blown $90,000 course here away for free on the podcast, but I am just a selfish friend like that, I guess. What's really cool about that is, is, is you can't make me do that. And here's why I could give you the perfect perfect worded questions to just rattle off to people and they will never work because without the context of you, them, and what you're capable of accomplishing together, there is no perfectly worded question. That's not the point. The point is understanding how to leverage questions to start a conversation, to carry on a conversation and then transition from that carried on conversation to a, Hey Bob, do you fucking want this thing or not? Right? The point is that we need to be asking questions. And this is, this is the thing with people selling their own thing. That is the struggle, not knowing what questions to ask. It's not exactly how they're worded. It's simple. Nathan, what is it you're trying to accomplish? right? You reached out to me for sales help. Cool. What are you trying to accomplish? I'm trying to figure out how to have better sales conversations. Okay, cool. So are you getting into a lot of sales conversations now on your own? No, but, but I want to be able to have the perfect sales conversation. Oh, okay, cool. So we can't even start with training you on how to have a sales conversation because you don't even have sales conversations going. Guess what? There's an opportunity for me to have another question. Are you trying to start sales conversations? Oh, yeah, 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 with everybody. Oh, really? Okay, cool. Tell me about everybody. I can keep going down this path to identify what your actual problem is. Well, in that instance, you're trying to talk to everybody. Guess what? Just because they need a sales page doesn't mean they need your sales page. Oh, my God, right? The bottom line is this. It's not what's in the question. It's what the, what the question accomplishes. I, as the person with the thing that you can buy, need to understand what is, what is it you actually need solved. And if I can understand that and I can honestly say, yeah, my thing solves that and we're the perfect match to do this together, then we've got an opportunity to work together. But a lot of people, like we talked about on the, on the last episode, a lot of people just want to take the money because they need that money. You might need a client, but you don't need this client. It's so hard for people to understand that, but it all starts with questioning. How do you start a conversation? Hey, Nathan, how's your day going? What the fuck is that? It's a question. Hey, Nathan, what are you up to today? What is that? It's a question. Hey, Nathan, what's going on? It's a question. Hey, Nathan, what are you trying to accomplish today? It's a question. Who in a conversation is leading a conversation between two people? The person asking the questions. Yeah, most people don't know that. Most people think that the person who's speaking is the person that's leading the conversation. And if you're doing a sales conversation correctly, the person with the thing to sell is not doing most of the talking. Well, how do you get that to happen? By asking questions. 